and from here now we have to arch some part of the um, some part of the roof to show the roof pattern to show the kind of roofing sheet we are using the pattern of the roofing sheet we are using so the next thing we are going to do before we do that is we offset some lines away from here from the plan to accommodate the arch we want to put here so we we'll do offset 50 and we'll start offsetting here and here i'll make sure that our initial ridge and gutter we have created is at the center so we offset to the left and right left and right left and right left and right So when we are done with this, we will fill it out the lines so that it looks beautiful. Do fill it multiple, your radius should be set to zero. And we select this and this, this and this. So we trim all the edges here now. So now that we are done, we we'll go to hatch and select this arch pattern a a r r s h k e and we'll come here and put the hatch here reduce the scale to one and Make sure you make the arch individually to each face so that you, you can be able to edit them. So, when you are done with this now, we pay attention to the pattern of the arch now, the direction of the pattern. You can look at it, it here now that this one is facing the right direction and almost everything is facing the same direction and which will not be like that on the actual pattern when you apply it real life the pattern on the roof um, in real life it will not be like this so we try and make some adjustments so to this now we change the angle to let's say 45 and see what we have not making sense let's change it to 90 so i think this is fine now at 90 and this is also fine the way it is so this also we we'll change this to 90 because it's almost these and these are almost facing the same size so we we'll do match properties select this and put this at 90 and this and this So we leave this the way it is. 
or we can change the angle to 180 anyone would feel like so changing it to 180 I'll leave it the way it is now we've changed it to 180 so this one will change the angle to 90 degree for this side change the angle to 90 and we we'll match properties to the rest of the side because we'll be facing the same way this and this and this now this is our roof plan and it is this same roof plan we'll use for the roof elevation now so if you don't understand anything you can drop your question 